Terry, this has been UMC's plan since last fall, and with the new security guards making their rounds around the hospital, UMC looks forward to stepping up their security. Every year, UMC takes an employee satisfaction survey, and on the most recent one, employees marked safety as their number one concern. They didn't feel safe in their jobs, they didn't feel safe particularly at night, and so they were really asking our administrative team to do something about that, and so this is a result of that. The security implemented for the last 20 years at UMC were off-duty Lubbock police officers. We had always relied on from one to three LPD officers that we would hire uh, on their off days, uh, you know, on their time off to come up here and, and staff the hospital at various times. But UMC decided to go a different direction this new year, with new level four armed security guards now walking the halls of the hospital, guarding anyone who's inside or around UMC. They have all completed that training. Some of them already had it, uh, and, they, and, and they came here. Some of our own staff, we retrained for those positions. The guards are marked clearly with a badge, tactical gear, and a firearm on their hip. They're expected to cover shifts 24 hours a day, seven days a week. We have about half a dozen now who are working, and then over the next couple of months, we'll keep adding more. This will cost us more uh, additional FTEs, paying for the training, that kind of stuff. Um, but we think it's worth it to address those security needs. Mr. Finley says uh, Senator Perry filed a bill in the Senate for UMC to establish their own police department, and they hope that will happen sometime this year.